This is Maitama district in Abuja. It's at the heart of a dispute between businesses and the local authority. Banks and other companies have been told they need to relocate to the central business district. If they refuse to move, they could be sealed up. Officials say notices have been handed into all buildings that have been converted to commercial use from residential status. Here on Ghana Street, businesses are still operating as normal. But it's not clear how long this will last. It's a move that's been roundly condemned by residents here. With COVID-19, I think it is not really necessary for now. So government should think of you know, helping the poor masses and also doing things to end the COVID-19 issue before of that. When you look at it, the most important thing is this. I think been they create suitable business areas for people to relocate to, it would have been fine. But like this, they will just wake up one day to say they will remove businesses from Maitama. Look at Zenith Bank, all the banks, commercial banks are located in this Maitama. So it is not fair for them to remove all these business premises from this place. The decision to take away the business activities in this area must have been um, thought about for a long time. And um, for them to come up with this now is not really the best, considering the economic hardship Nigerians are going through. I think they should um, uh, pipe low a little. Uh, let's see how businesses move. As a government, you have to put all that it takes for your people to enjoy. You have not done such things and your people are trying to do things on their own and you are pushing them away. I think it's not the right thing. Officials say this is just one area they're targeting and that 200 hectares of land is being used illegally. For businesses in Maitama, the countdown is on. Possible eviction is just days away. Those who don't move will find out if it's just a threat or if their doors get closed for good. Punarmam Fentola, Arise News.